What is going on guys? How are you guys doing today? Welcome back to Roblox Fire Alarm Inspection number 82. We are back at it again with another Roblox Fire Alarm Inspection video. If you haven't checked out the recent uh, video, I think the recent video was Mini System Test 2 and then the last recent video was uh, Roblox Fire Alarm Inspection number 81 which is the 500 subscriber series that we did a little bit ago. So make sure you go check out those videos if you haven't caught up already. So we are back at the uh, backup building or the backup event center. Uh, and you, the last time you seen this building was back in Roblox Fire Alarm Inspection number 78. And there's not really much change. The only changes, this is some changes, but not a lot. Starting off in the building, of course, pool stations are the same. We still have the same enunciator right here. Uh, only thing that we changed was the alarms. We changed the Willock e E50s or EH50s or whatever, 70s. We changed those to system sensor speaker strobes. Uh, we have one right here. We have one here. Uh, the Willock RS, RSS is still the same by the panel. I don't think I'm going to change that for a little bit. Uh, in this little hallway, we have a, uh, one right here. Another speaker show right here has changed. Speaker show in here changed as well. Speaker show in the little hangout room changed. Cafeteria. Oh, yeah, right here as well, and then right here, and right here. In the back, pretty much everything in the back is the same. We still have these Spectral Advances set to code 3. These are the uh, older models. Uh, we still have the ESC and Technic speaker strobes here. In the temporary classrooms, hold the alarms have changed again, same thing. Changing this one and this one. Temporary building, whatever you want to call it, same thing. And everything else is the same. Still have the system sensor L series in the little uh, room right here with the uh, power supply or the trifles, whatever you want to call it, that can, that controls the system. Uh, flip the switch for power. So, yeah. Without further ado, guys, I advise you turn your volume down. This system is loud. Um, like I said, there's not really major changes. We just changed out the Willox systems to Spectral or uh, speaker strobes or system center speaker strobes, whatever you want to call it. That's pretty much what we just changed. Pool stations, pool stations are the same, and panels the same, and the same. The rest of the alarms are the same. So here we go. But oh, uh, we also another change. We did change out the uh, temp three tone, and yeah. So here we go. Attention please, there has been a report of an emergency. Proceed calmly to the nearest exit and leave the building immediately. Do not use the elevators. Use stairwells where necessary. All handicapped occupants shall use the building evacuation plan. Attention please, there has been a report of an emergency. Proceed calmly to the nearest exit and leave the building immediately. Do not use the elevators. Use stairwells where necessary. All handicapped occupants shall use the building evacuation plan. Attention please, there has been a report of an emergency. Proceed calmly to the nearest exit and leave the building immediately. Do not use the elevators. Use stairwells where necessary. All handicapped occupants shall use the building evacuation plan. Attention please, there has been a report of an emergency. Proceed calmly to the nearest exit and leave the building immediately. Do not use the elevators. Use stairwells where necessary. All handicapped occupants shall use the building evacuation plan. Alright, we're 
reset the panel and reset the grid system. Attention please, there has been a report of an emergency. Proceed calmly to the nearest exit. Alright, so that's going to wrap up for Robots for Learn session number 82. If you haven't already, make sure you go check out the recent uh, videos on the channel. Um, like I said, not really m nothing has changed in the system besides replacing the Willock to the system sensor. Uh, and of course, with this system, I didn't change out the system sensor L. Nor did I change up the specular fans, so they still over they still kind of overtake the speaker strobes, but I mean it's whatever. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.